Ladies and gentlemen, boards and girls, welcome back to part 11. Sure. I'm gonna load this. 18 hours and 35 minutes we've been playing this game. That's a long time to be hanging out with you, man. That is a long time. <laughs> eh? Michael Shrugzins. All right, what were we doing here? Well, I think we should level up. Oh my god, you love leveling up, Jesus. It's so obnoxious. All you want to do is lie just up. level up. What? Our lie? Yeah. It's a lot higher when we have like two other partners, though. Yeah, but that's only depending on the partners. How many times are we going to use lie? One. There you go. It's at 70. Is that good enough for you? 75. We're going to use all 10 points in that? Yeah. That's so dumb. We're so late in the game. So, but our guns are fine. They're at like 80 and 60 and stuff. What about defense? I don't care about that. We don't use dodge or block. Those are melee things. Shut the fuck up. I guarantee there's going to be a speed check that's lie 75. Oh, you're going to guarantee it? I guarantee it. Okay. There you go. I think that was stupid. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. How you like speak stuff? Yes, but it's over a hundred already. Only depends on who's in the party. <sighs> now all our skills are high enough to satiate wow. my. Wow. Plus fifty science weapon damage. Perfect. Really? Yes. Done. So now our. So now our. Yes. That's gonna do 117. I guess that's cool. All three of these are energy. They're not science though. What's the difference? The only things that are science are guns like that with the blue stuff around. How do you know? Where does it say that? Because that's what a science weapon is. Prove it to me. Also, oh, it says science weapon down yeah, there. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Damn it. So that was literally a terrible choice of a perk. I'll undo it. You can't. You want to bet? <laughs> oh, look. I undid it. Stupid Michael. Unbelievable. This is, this is how your mother raised you? I proved it using science. Let's go back up to the top. See what we're missing in the top. Missing? 25 damage on a loaded party. No. Not good. 20% walk speed. Not no. 15% companion crit chance. Not bad. Eh. Vendor price is Don't down. Don't care. Unlock the ability to fast travel when encumbered. Don't care. Really? That seems like good. 50 grams. Nope. We're out yeah, of that. we already put 100. No need that. Okay. That's all trash. Go to tier 2. 65%. Movement penalty to minus 65% movement penalty to accuracy That's when moving. I don't like to shoot when I'm moving, though. Actually, maybe I am. 50% science weapon damage. 50% science weapon damage. 25% movement speed during TTD. Yeah. 5 meter mil, met, minute meter interactable highlight range. That seems not. I don't even know what that means. It means like if if the hitbox is here for like if you're opening a chest, you could be five meters. That seems like such a waste. It's like, just walk closer. What are you stupid? Like you could just hi like they highlight in a. It's like a laziness perk. <laughs> Twenty percent vendor buying price. Uh, wait. Oh, they buy. Yeah, all right, sure. Twenty-five percent chance to rest a companion ability, to reset a companion ability cooldown each critical. You always forget hit. about those, so no. Chance to reset a companion ability when they use it when using the other companion's ability. What? So if you use one of their other abilities, it refreshes the other sometimes. Minus 20% companion ability cooldown for each of your kills. Again, you don't use it enough, so. Minus 50% consumable weight. Don't care. We don't have consumables. Carrying capacity bonus from companions. Nope, don't care. Bonus dialogue when you have no companions. Okay, okay don't care. Whenever you're affected by a harmful combat effect, you deal more damage. 20% damage. 70% hmm. movement speed during TTD for 5 seconds. Uh, increase the armor rating skill from any armor you wear. I kind of like that. That seems good. Plus 100% skill bonus? What does that mean? If you're, if it gives a 5 skill bonus, it gives a 10 skill bonus instead. That seems great. Let's do that one. Lie. Lie, lie, lie. What the hell are you singing? Putting the long guns. Whatever, man. That's what I was going to do. I want to diversify. I want to diversify. Okay. Diversify my portfolio. Should we get some of these side quests and just finish them off? We don't have many. I mean, we could, but I kind of want to. I, was... I worry that if we go do the last one, we're never gonna, we're never gonna go back and do these. We're never gonna have a chance. Well, who's to say that's the last one? I don't know. It's making a big deal out of it. It's one of those things where it's like, are you ready to do this now, or would you like to go get prepared? 
And that always means there's no turning back after you do it in games. Maybe. The first perk in tier two is really good. That, nah, actually, what is it? It's the minus 65% movement penalty to accuracy. I didn't know there was that much of a penalty, though, I guess. It means when you're moving the accuracy. Uh, yeah, you might be moving more than you think when you're shooting. Like, moving it forward. Appar I think I have a business idea for you. Apparently, you and Mike doing cube banter is workout good workout music. I was surprised, too. Still, though. New line of magic theme workout music? Make that holiday money? You know? You never know. Bad. Not Let's bad. record an album. No, we just do banter. Oh. Slaughterhouse Clive, that's actually a very clever name. Get him out of the sublights way alternately search factory for to sabotage Clive's operation. What do you want to do? You tell me what to do and I'll do it. What's the task? It's just like getting a bunch of money from people. Oh, yeah, those are dumb. <clears throat> Let's do that. Okie dokie. The override cartridge will hand over control to the station's systems to sublight, le legitimizing Lilia's claim over the salvage. The problem with doing these quests... Yes, Michael. ...is the fact that yes. we're just going to get more quests out of these quests. I was thinking that too, but there has to be an if end. If you're looking for crew members LA or Felix... No, I'm not. A I said I'm not. Thank you. Also, we haven't been to... Espertatus or Typhoon. That's good, man. Captain. It's emitting a very weak docking signal. I almost mislabeled it as normal etheric static. The laser sniper? Where is that? I want gonna... a laser sniper. Boy, you and me both, my dude. Check battery level. Before initiating an extended sanitization session. Oh. What? That's weird. Can you not go through it? Oh, I can. That was weird. One case of UDL concussive mines signed by Chief of Security Ida Kimball. Warning contents may have shifted. Blah, blah, blah. God, I love how they, how they just leave ammo everywhere in this game. Everyone's so careless. What is this thing? Got some smokes. Smoking. Oh, smoking. Remember uh, from the mask? It's a Jim Carrey movie. Is That's that a mine. I got a little ringing in my ear. Cannot use while in combat. What am I in combat with the other mines? I don't know. What my about behind is, you? My nose is itching. Or right there. What's in there? There's nothing in here. You sure? I mean, I'm not sure there's nothing, uh, no items in here, but I thought they were looking for guys, is what I meant. Purple berry munch. You're a purple berry butt munch. Wow. Got him. How rude. Ooh, a necklace. How beautiful. Guess we got everything here. Oh, an Adreno to go with my 400 Adreno that I have now. All right, let's go in. Oh, wait, we couldn't, so we got to go out here. And... Okay, there's some things in there for sure. Or there's... Let's give these little fellas a wide berth, Captain. Uh... All right. It doesn't matter what comes, fresh feels better in life. Uh, okay. Gotta restore the power, I guess. So I don't know how to get to those guys. I'm apparently in combat. Behind you. Where behind? No, no. To the right. 
To the right. There's a room over there. To the right, to the right. Everything you own in the box to the right. In the closet, that's my stuff. Having been hit in the head 120 times, your mental frac facility faculties have been permanently affected. Mind attributes a negative one for reward perk. No thanks. They're gonna be like, these guys haven't taken any negative effects. Oh, you can't just open it and do the do the jobby. Sealed. 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 Okay. They're all sealed. Alright, let's go back to the computer and hope we're not in combat anymore, I guess. Oh, here's hold on, there's another door. Is this where it came from? Yes. Yes, because there's no other. Make me feel some type of way. Oh, oh hold on. Oh, can't go through that. Not an option. All right. That's where we came from. That's where we go. Where did you come from? Cotton Eye Joseph. All right. Oh, there we go. Modified generator mode at normal. Uh, okay. Uh, maintenance logs. Do this. Repair toilet. Oh. Nice. Oh, I see you have activated your holographic shroud, Captain. I didn't mean to. Excellent. Becoming indistinguishable from an authentic UDL trooper will prove advantageous to your current situation. What's going on? A UDL vessel has been tracking our position and just recently docked with the station. Oh. They are patching into the station's transmission lines now. I cannot stop. I've been waiting for this day since we tagged your ship in Cascadia, Captain. I. Wait, who are you? No one told me we had security forces deployed on the Shut up and take my money! You guys are great. I'm going to bed, but hope you guys have a blast at this game. And thank you so much, Josh. Really appreciate it, buddy. Nice you are awesome. You. Have a good night, Josh, you boy. I will see you tomorrow at some point, I'm sure. Always appreciate you, man. Thank you so much, dude. Have a good sleep. My team has already handled the issue. Your squad can depart. The smuggler's been handled. Oh, look, only 55. Uh, your team isn't clear at the dock at the station. That's need to know, soldier. Now depart before you're reassigned to sewage detail. I like one. Roger that. Just as a precaution, I'm sure you won't mind if we turn on the station security systems. Can't be too careful. We hate to leave this location undefended after a close call with outlaws. Yeah, of course. Don't even worry about it. I already activated the Automax. Your readout must be on a delay. Do I look like I need some rolled rust bucket as backup? I like number one. Okay. Hmm. That should have been fixed by now. As you say, we'll just head out then. Safe travel, soldier. The Got him. From the station. That was probably so loud. They appear to be departing into space. Dad used to say words have power. What a bunch of you idiots! I'll check those do donation notifications a little bit uh, after we're done streaming, and I'll see if I can fix them. Okay, so the power is on, right? Look how bright it is in here. It's beautiful. Wait, you're not gonna go in that room? What room? Where you need to go. I can't. Oh, can't. There's something here. A lot of these doors still don't have, they don't have ways to be open still. Anything in the kitchen? Someone's in the kitchen with mucho. Someone's in the kitchen on it. You want some deep fried sisty bits? No. That's basically just pork rinds. You're a pork rind. Buddy, you ain't kidding. M -m 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 got him shot. What about that other door? I mean, I'm going on all the doors I can find. What about the one up here? See if that's... I doubt it. Yeah. I actually don't think our, our uniform matters right now. Because I don't think there's any really, like... Step lively, Captain. The floor's got... Tea. floor's got... Oh, shit. What? Wait, what? Is the floor electrified? Yes. Yes. 
Let's see if we can turn it off. Security routines. Disengage checkpoint security. You think that did it? I guess we'll find out. Oh, an ordnance control helmet. Is it better? No. Not even close. Nothing maybe. has ever been better than this helmet we found in the middle of the game. Come on, one time. Oh yeah, we did it. Thank you. Two, five. Hosh twenty five. Thanks so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Oh. Um. Uh. Is this where? Uh, uh huh. This is weird. What does this do? Subject should not be revived until a method for stabilizing its condition is found. Okay. Subject will need extensive nuclein resequencing for any chance of viable extraction. I'm so sorry to end up like this, James. We'll come back for you all and fix this. I swear on it. Oh, this is interesting. Wow. I didn't do anything. So I'm just going to just die or make sure resuscitation devices are on hand upon revival. Please hold on, Claire. We almost had it this time. I swear we'll bring you back. Richard. Hold me. What up, robots? It is Wednesday, my robots. shut this off for a little bit you're good okay um oh unlock personal quarters did it modify systems access protocols insert the sublight over like override cartridge how do you feel about that that's that's literally our quest so yeah you should probably do okay it. nailed it return project summary messages got them logs got them got them Oh, oh, okay. Just want to make sure I Job click on. We can go home to the ship, right? Hold on a tick. Don't we know Chartrand from Cascadia? Give me all of your goods. Got him. Got him. Got him. No, 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 nice. Yeah, we didn't have to do any killing, barely. You did it. Good job. Here I go, killing again. Is this dude just hang out here? Like, we have no interaction with this thing? As far as I can tell. That's crazy. You're crazy, man. Oh, interesting. Interesting. In the toilet. In the toilet. That's a good... I like your In the Toilet song, man. It's pretty good, right? Yeah, I think you should really... I made it myself. <laughs> well, God, I hope so. Is that what you say when you make Boom Boom in the toilet, too? I made it myself. What's making Boom Boom? That's when you take a dookie in the toilet. What's that? A pooper? Uh, no, still I have no idea. I'm sorry, what? Still no idea. Okay. Look, man, I don't know what you're saying right now. In the ghetto. I feel like before we go on this final quest, we should like max out all our stuff in a workbench. Yeah, I like your, I like where your head's at. What, what are these? Mean, what else are we gonna use our chips for? There's a lot of like red on our map, but like there's nothing. Is it all because these? Because those, yeah, we, those are technically enemies. Even uh, though they're, yeah, they're just not awake. I got you. I got you. I feel you. You know when you do the old stank bottom, Michael. Make oh, boom no, stank bottom. God, that it's is stank cool. bottom. Michael, are you playing dumb or have you lived your life without taking a poop? I'll never it could die. really be. Fi it's really a coin toss here, man.
Is this where we want to go? Or is it just like on... Is this... I think that's our ship. You mean our chip? Mm-hmm. Okay. A reminder to all crew members. There is only one... See, that was quick. I think that mission would have been way more brutal without the skill checks. With what? Without without what? Without the skill checks. Oh yeah, for sure. I think this whole game fight is like a whole army. This whole game is more difficult without skill checks. Hey man, we running through. Uh, what are we running? What are we playing Jedi next? I suppose so. Hmm. You get that controller yet? I'm getting either tomorrow or Thursday. I have like four packages coming in the next two days. Robots. Robots in disguise. Finally, a base of our own. Soon we'll have eyes on every corner of the system. Well done, Captain. Uh, is that all? I didn't do this for charity. Wow, Intimidate 100 for that one? Nice. Technically, you did. Among other things, Sublight is a charity, legally speaking. Or so my lawyers tell me. It's a tax thing. Here, just take the bits. Aside from the automated security, did you meet any resistance at the station? A UDL gunship buzzed the station, but I convinced them to back off. It was an easy job, no surprises. Hmm. Why one? Might as well. Seems like the lowest skill check ever. Why would they leave an asset like that unprotected? Unless... Could the station be a trap? Unlikely. But possibly. One more thing to consider. I've been less than honest with you. Oh my god. Your assignments weren't strictly about the salvage business. You might have figured that out already. Is this about you cloak and dagger warnings? I'm listening. I hope I'm due for a raise. I'm listening. After the monarch job, I started connecting the dots. I didn't like the picture. Then what we found at station 1084 confirmed my fears. You and I have stumbled onto something big. Something none of us were meant to know. My dad. The truth about the human tailbone? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right, I'm saying that. I'm thinking more along the lines of the sapient species paradox. Oh, say that's the same thing. Ask yourself why a skeleton crew was studying that Alta Vitae gas in secret. Ask yourself why stockpiles were hidden on a planet full of monsters. The Sapien Paradox, you think it's about discovery of intelligent life? Wrong. Oh. I think it's about intelligent life discovering us. Aliens. I'm talking about aliens. They're the ones responsible for the deaths at aliens. 1084. And who Thank knows you. what else? We have to put a stop to it. Aliens. 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 Really? really? I like aliens. Aliens. I'm saying it's aliens. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm not even asking you to believe it. But I need to act on this threat to the colony, and I can't do it alone. This doesn't feel at all right, Captain. The crew is skeptical. That's good. I don't want you walking into the unknown with blindfolds on. I assume you have questions? A few. This is completely insane. Skip to the part where I get paid. I don't care what hallucinogens you're on. I think a few is good. If we're going to see this through, I'll need your trust and commitment. Now's the time for setting doubts aside. When you say aliens, what are we talking about here? Enough, tell me what needs to be done. I really don't know what to make of this. I'm going to say... I always want to know more about aliens, man. Conspiracy. And this is a mission where we get to actually fight aliens and we would have skipped it? Assuming they haven't all been replaced. Dummy. This is an invasion of our very cells. That damned gas is mixing our nuclein with halcyon biology to twist us, change us. Make us more like those monsters on Monarch. Interesting. 
I haven't seen any evidence of aliens. I joined Subbit so I could do crimes. Not so I could do crimes. You guys want to do crimes? Oh, the little green bastards must pay. Wow, I haven't seen any evidence of aliens. No kidding. That's how they want it. When I lined up the evidence aliens. in my She's like the George Sukalos of this game. That's his name, right? Looking yeah. Back yeah. At me. This is my data talking, not my anxiety or lack of sleep. How do you know it's I'm not an alien spy on a mission to silence you? Enough telling me needs to be done. I really don't know what to make of this. I'm going to say three. Okay. If you don't believe me, go pay a visit to the puppet master who's working against her own kind. Dr. Chartrand is the crooked psychopath behind the gas experiments. She sold out her species. I need you to put a bullet through her soul. <coughs> Woo! Dang. Murder isn't covered in my contract contractor employment agreement. Why does Dr. Chartrand need to die? It sounds messy, but I'll take the job. I'm gonna ask three. Yeah. She's a research scientist and a damn good one. Before UDL poached her, she engineered a 0.2% increase in cysty pig juiciness. Now she's doing the same I thing. I love a juicy humanity. cysty pig, if you know what I mean. Her fingerprints were all over station 1084. I am allergic to aliens. You saw what she did to her team. Aliens! <gasps> When did Sub like it so principled? Your concern for the fate of our species is admirable. It's cute that you think that about me. I just want to add savior of humanity to my resume. I've got ambitions outside of this office, you know. Besides, this way Sublight gets first dibs on alien salvage. Oh, here we go. The lab I passed through didn't seem that evil. Where does Chartrand fit into your alien conspiracy theory? Murder isn't covered. Sounds messy. Oh, now it makes sense. I'm gonna do science one. Do you usually come across innocent people trapped in suspension tanks? Because some of us would call that excessive. Nobby. Remember, the tanks were just the shit she left behind. Just imagine the experiments she carted off to her next lab. Uh, where does she fit into your alien conspiracy? We're far beyond theories. Chartrand's logs, the gas, the suspension tanks. How much proof do you need? Wake up, Captain. That's not really proof. That's just An invasion coincidence. Needs yeah. Collaborators working from the shadows. She That's all circumstantial the evidence. Board, unlimited funds and a colony full of sheep. Sounds messy, but I'll take the job. I guess so. This key card will get you through the front door of her Byzantium estate. Don't ask how I got it. I feel you like we can talk like to her and answer. figure out the truth anyway, so. By now, the other side knows what you're doing. Don't trust anything Chartrand says. She's compromised down to the bone. Maybe even deeper than that. I don't know, man. Well, now this quest line got interesting. I, I was like, oh, I hope Parv Parvati's with us because she'll probably have some insight because of science-y stuff, but she didn't, so I was like, eh. Well, she's not really into science. She's into engineering. You guys are just blind to the alien threat. Wake up, Moochel. She's He's right. Superfritz is like, how much do I have to do to get you to play some Dark Souls? Dear God. How, how much do our Dark Souls have you played? Uh, I've played the first one, and then we played Bloodborne, which Bloodborne's a lot different because there's no blocking. Yeah. Is this the right way to go? Tartarus? No, don't, don't go to that. Go around it. Wait, there you go. Where the where am I though? Where is this? You're in uh whatever this ship's called. You're in the big chip, okay? Just go back to your chip. I was trying, I couldn't figure out which way to go though. Is it this way? Oh, you do. Go towards the green, man. You're going towards your ship. No, that's the it's on the main quest now. We don't want that. We want this one. Oh, there we go. still go to our chip. <laughs> Stop saying chip, god damn it. Wait, maybe we don't. Yeah we do. It's right there. Maybe not. Oh, look, it's Dr. Oh, we're going to Dr. Chartrand. Yeah, but it's going to lead us to our ship. Oh, you're right. And that's just going to that's just telling us what our goal is. Dark Souls oh, content is basically the only other thing I watch on Twitch. Yeah, I think we get like we just get owned basically. So. I feel like you just watch me die over and over and over. That is part of the challenge. And I would get though. super discouraged and I'd Also be like, like you've always said you're not really good at like reflex based things. I not anymore. I used to be better. In my younger days. So that probably wouldn't be good for you. In my younger days. I guess I could play that. You could. I'm going to get the controller, so. Yeah. Maybe yeah. we'll do it. I figure even Jedi will be able to switch off. Uh, This is a Byzantium. 
We are now in orbit above Byzantium, Captain. Isn't this the city where we have to fight all the guards? I don't know, it's Captain, aliens, Michael. I wish to offer my commendations for convincing the UDL's gunship to leave HRS-1084. I did not favor the idea of being stripped and sold for parts. All right, cool, thanks. Um, I mean, this is the quest where we get to see aliens, Michael. Who do you want to take with? I think I'm fine with the team we have now. Really? You want you don't want to take someone who talks over the robot? Felix? Uh, let's take Nyoka. Oh, maybe that's a mistake. Maybe we should have took the doctor. Unbelievable. Who, Vicar Max? No, the doctor. Ellie? Yeah. That's what I said. Then do that. Why are we so far from the door? Oh, uh, I guess I could send her back, but I probably can't call someone to it. Yes, yes, I would. What was the, what was that in response to? I think he means watching us die over and over again. Wow. He's like, that's the only reason I watch this shit. So now we have someone who knows about medicine and science and someone well, who knows about I'm engineering. Than a week old Borst. Big surprise. I like that there's three female companions and two male companions. That's a that's a nice change of pace. And one robot who is neutral. Yeah, that was like, I don't know. I could go either way with this guy. Hey. Oh, we've been here before. Oh, this is Byzantium. Oh, this is what you mean we had to kill everybody. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do that. Go that way. I forgot. I mean, isn't oh, there a bench? Ooh. These are I think our armor's fine. I don't think we have to tinker that. I think our weapons are fine, too. 2,000, well, 3,000, 4,000. What about that one? Tinkered items, no greater than five levels. Okay, can't okay. do that one. What about... Don't care about that. Really? Hold on. I mean, we put all our points in long guns, so... Yeah, but our short guns aren't that terrible. What's this thing? Shit cannon? I mean, it's just awesome. hard to it's hard to compete with like seven nineteen, a thousand, and seven eighty eight. Yeah, why don't we level up our shocky? Which is that? Which, which no over that one. This is a shotgun. The sh no, I mean shocky. It's a shock weapon. Oh, it's a shocky because it costs four thousand. So what? It's just not worth it for like. Really? Yeah, what I don't. So we're gonna spend our money on. We're near the end of the game. Because I'll just I'd rather hoard it, Michael, like a fucking dragon. Okay. <sighs> And let it go to waste. It's the wrong way. Well, there's You're always going the wrong way. There's a lot going on, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I'm old and my physical skills aren't good and my mental skills aren't good and nothing about me in terms of games is good, Michael. I'm so sorry, okay? Okay, boomer. Wow, that's messed up. <laughs> that is messed up. You want some purple berry crunch, my dude? No. Okay. Well, you don't have to have any. Oh, these guys are just these guys are just enemies now. Guys, if I killed you easily last time, it's just worse this time. I don't care. I'll steal from this stupid ass city. Fuck them. I mean, I wasn't gonna kill you. Oh, all right. Well. These guys always have good loot, at least. I just came here. I wanted to check out your city. 
See what you had going on. I was going to bring my family here on vacation. Did I miss something? Did Frank just ruin the global financial and housing markets? Um. I like how you shoot the guy with the gun not raised up first. He was closer. Michael, they're both dead. Okay? I don't want to hear any... God, these guys sound like they die really bad deaths. What was that, that noise? noise? <laughs> exactly. What is this happening to me right now? Don't know. I felt like I was tripping balls there. As the kids say. Oh, it's that shit that like, that seeks the other dudes out. Oh yeah, this weapon's nuts, dude. Oh, so when you stand near it, it hurts you too. Really? I'm not getting hurt at all. Oh, it radiates off you. Oh, yeah. Interesting. Uh. Wow, oh, this gun's nuts. Yeah, apparently N-ray shit is bonkers, dude. Oh man. I'm gonna. Let me uh, upgraded this thing, huh? I want to make some changes here. I want to put this in number two. Actually, I'll put this in number one now. You're my new favorite. You're my new favorite child. Hey, Hunter. Hunter is my new I still don't know child. what that noise is. Neither do I. It sounds like monsters. It does. Can I go in this door? Oh. Do we have a key? Well, are we... Is it saving? It doesn't... We're in combat. We can't. Oh, for crying out loud. That's why I was like... Door. Well, I don't, because like, if she's standing right there and she wants to talk to me immediately, I don't want to be like, oh, I guess I can't do anything. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't. I don't actually understand. Do you really not? You're always going to be in combat because these guys are considered combat. Oh, my God. Like, there's certain doors you open in, like, Fallout where, like, as soon as you walk through the door, the person's standing there and they initiate dialogue with you. Okay. It wasn't the case, but I just wanted to make sure. How did you get in there? This reminds me of... Oh, never mind. What's Good that? call. Oh, never mind. I guess everything. Stealing. What's this? What can I do here? Logs. Pew. The first extraterrestrials. Ever since our species became aware of itself, we imposed our spirit on the worlds we touched. Colonialism worked for a time, but our oldest tricks didn't work in Halcyon, did it? Now we are the ones who must bow to a force greater than ourselves. We are the ones who must adapt. Update. Wine makes me too introspective. Perhaps it'll balance out with vodka. Wow. You a drunk. Unseal the entrance. I don't know where that I don't know where that entrance is, but we'll find it. I bet this I'm was that's it. it. Should we look around more first? Yeah, right. definitely. Nothing there. Fake door. Fake door. Uh, that's this the door, door I came in, so that's literally the only place to go. Yep. Okay. See my good, huh? Are you ready? I'm ready. That's top of the line equipment. Better than most hospitals, even. Okay, save it again. That's far enough. What are you doing here? How did you even get inside? I'm a baller. I'm the one asking the questions. Your alien mind tricks won't fool me. Li Lilia, Lilia Hagen sent me to kill you. I want to say this because I want to be like, this is what's this is the situation. Can you talk us out of it? But I don't want to be like, well, I'm going to kill you first. 
Well, you saved it, so let's find out what happens. If anyone ever tries to off me, I hope they do it with the same professional courtesy. <laughs> Hagen. I've never heard of her. Is she from the board? Damn it. I knew this would happen. Lilia runs sub sublight salvage and groundbreaker. Good boss. Bit of a live wire. Why would the board want you dead? Cut the distractions. I know about your alien conspiracy. Let's go to yeah. To keep me quiet. But if you didn't know that, I'm guessing they didn't send you. I always assumed they would put a bullet in my head one of these days. I don't know anyone named Hagen. Lilia runs sublight salvage on groundbreaker. Good boss. Bit of a live wire. Cut the distractions. I know about your alien conspiracy. Ooh. I like one or two. I'm not sure. I'm not sure she is a good boss, though. I feel like she's super manipulative. My what conspiracy? Okay. Let's talk about this. Please. I think there's been a crucial misunderstanding. I'm listening. The alien theory did seem a bit far-fetched. Yeah, but we saw it in our log. Just give me a second to explain myself. She was drinking, though. If you still want to shoot me, at least it'll be for an accurate reason. Okay. If you came looking for some elaborate scheme, it isn't here. All I'm doing is trying to keep Halcyon alive. What are you doing, Doctor? This information is beyond classified. You can write me up in your report. It hardly matters. I'm researching a new way to feed the colony. The crops we transplanted from Earth don't give us the nutrients we need. Our colonists might not realize it yet, but they're starving. This is startling, but it doesn't explain the research I found. Wait, you're telling me this is all about vegetables? I saw a presentation about this in Rockwell's office. Didn't look good. Do you always have corporate guards in your home? I like three. Just straight to the point. Huh. I, I like one. It doesn't explain the research I found. What do you want? The food we grow here barely sustains human life. The colony won't last under these conditions. So the board let me approach the problem from a different angle. I believe that I could adapt humans to live on Halcyon's terms. That I could change us. Give us the ability to derive sustenance from the nutrients the food does have. Adaptation didn't save your research team. All you have to show for it is a lab full of preserved colleagues. Hold on, what about the aliens? That's where I'm on board. That's All where right. I'm at. Look around. We're the only intelligent aliens in Halcyon. Uh, all you have to show for it is a lot full of preserved colleagues. Wallado, what's going on, buddy? Thank you so much for the resub, my I dude. Know. I was there. Thomas was the first to take the gas. A simple test, he said. I told him not to, but he insisted. We learned a lot from his autopsy. Enough that we could try it on each other and know when to stop. No one else died. I must find a cure so his sacrifice isn't in vain. You burned through a lot of valuable scientists to arrive at zero solutions. I'm surprised you didn't have more support from them. I'm going to go with one. Okay. I wouldn't allow us to experiment on convicts or the unemployed. It's wrong, no matter what the law says. Everyone agreed. We accepted the risks. I'm desperate. I've already asked all the best institutes on Earth for help. Years ago, we sent a message out on the Cornelius Vanderbilt, but heard nothing back. Enough talk, where do we go from here? Isn't Cornelius Vanderbilt one of the assault cruisers patrolling Halcyon? The board wants to adapt the entire population of Halcyon. That's a hell of a story. Lily Hager still wants me to kill you. Hagen still wants me to kill wow. you. Uh, two? Mm -hmm. It's been missing for over two years now. They never reestablished contact after the skip to Earth. Of course, the board is keeping that under wraps. Imagine losing something with that many guns on it. How'd you lose half a pair of ships like it were a sock? <laughs> the board is uneasy about letting the colony know, seeing as half of their military force vanished without a trace. Uh, Lilia sent me after a conspiracy, but it looks like I found a cover-up instead. Colonists might get unruly if they realize there was only one boot on their neck. Uh, if the board's authority is vulnerable, that's a crisis waiting. Anytime anyone wants to say attack, I'm just like, alright, I, I can only get three options. Uh, I like two or three. I like two. The board also has its brand to uphold. If you can't trust the brand, what else is there? Uh, the board wants to adapt the entire population of Halcyon. Once we can replicate a success, the board will move to rewire our nucleon. 
With any luck, our next generation will be eating and thriving off Halcyon crops. Knowing what the board considers a success, that doesn't give me a lot of hope. You're right. You really think the board got our best interests at heart? I mean, they say, but I'm just not sure. We haven't made enough strides to advance the plan. Hardly any at all. But we have to keep trying. Enough talk, where do we go from here? You came to kill me. I assume that's still on the table. Please don't. If I die, there's no one who can reproduce our work. Every sacrifice will have been for nothing. And we'll be no closer to a solution that feeds the colony. You know, Phineas Wells, once I get him out of prison, you two should work together. That dude's crazy! What do you think, Ellie? Parvati, how do you feel we handle this? Oh, what do you think? I kind of like one. Alright, I'll say one. The one on the wanted posters? <laughs> they say he's an anarchist. A madman, a butcher. I'll do it. What? Doctor. What choice do I have, Commander? That didn't take much convincing. In the future, try and stay away from plans that hack our species. So is there really no alien conspiracy? Oh, man. For the last time... <laughs> no. I need to get out of here. Phineas can contact me when he's ready to work together. For now, oh, man. I'd better pack up the lab and head somewhere discreet. You failed Not my... so fast. Captain, what you just learned is beyond your clearance. Hell, it's beyond mine. Give me one reason why I should let you walk out of here. Buddy, my life. speech is like a hundred, man. It's less work than hauling my corpse out of here. <laughs> Wrong answer. Oh god, I have to kill this idiot. I probably shouldn't use this kind of gun on yeah, on robots. How about this kind of gun? Man, there's so many people in vats in this in this. In these science, in these labs. I got another fight, mate. Well, I guess I can steal all this stuff now, cause there ain't nobody here. I hope you're. I hope the lady hey, lived. That's company property. Oh. Oh. What do you think you're doing? Are you serious right now? Oh, my mistake. <sighs> wow. Like he just saved her life, and she's like, Hey, don't you take that bit! Re repeatedly getting caught by guards has made you jittery doubly, doubly so when roaming around restricted areas or sneaking. Personality attributes negative one. Reject. I just don't want to- I've worked so hard for all of also, my- Also, the perks that are left, like, barely in many are even worth that. Man. She was like, excuse me. You spared my life, but don't you take my three two light ammo. That I probably won't use because I'm a scientist. Hopefully when you get out there, you can fast travel to your chip. Doubt it. Where's that? Where can I get this plasma cutter? We've had one. They weren't that great. I've had your mother. She wasn't that great. Wow. Oh, we leveled up. Uh, healed at 24% health when down, when downed. So when she dies, she gets 25 health back. Try again. Seconds. That seems good. What, this? Oh, the down thing. Yeah, I agree. Getting back to my chip. Son of a You gonna level up, man? Oh my god, I hear you. I feel like we level up constantly, dude. Where you wanna go? I think our, I think we're good here, man. I don't know, 404 and an 80. Yeah, it just depends on who's in the party. Uh, I mean, weapons, right? Get our long guns up to 100. With, uh, or with our friend. Done. Alright, let's run back to the okay, ship, I guess. Take care of your pistol, Dr. Fenhill. I oughta. Kept me alive this long. I mean, you treat it nice. Makes me happy to see, because I feel the same way about my wrench. 
Look, it's a tool that does a job. Feelings got nothing to do with it. Very good. Thanks, nerd. No, not that way. Huh? My dear fellow, you know. Is it? Is that way? Yeah, look at all the death. Yeah, we really, really ruined this city. This city is a, a hot goddamn mess. Oh, that was a waste of bullets. Yeah, now I only have 2,514 instead of exactly. 2,517. Idiot. I hear Sears makes a decent plasma cutter. Who knew? Is that true? I don't even think there are Sears anymore. No, I think they're all out of business. No Robux either. How long do you think it's before like all physical stores close down? Crew report. A couple weeks. Video goes wow. Surprise. Come and knock on our door. We arrived at the groundbreaker. Mike is waiting for you. When the kisses are hers and hers. I have, why do I have three companies stuck in my head? Uh, cause you're dumb. Yeah, that checks out. And I wish she had cell phones in this universe to get you like, hey, the job's done. Can I just call you and tell you what's it's done? It's weird as a super futuristic game, but like we don't have cell phones. Yeah, maybe the future doesn't have cell phones. You ever think about that? Well, that seems stupid. Is it done? Well, I'm not going to kill her. Well, damn. Contractor grew a conscience. As your employer, I'm both angry and disappointed. I'll add that to your file. Well, let's hold on a Technically, second. Technically, I owe you an exit interview. Care to justify your betrayal of our species? Or are we finished here? You misunderstand, sure, Transducer. She's the best shot at survival in Halcyon. You're crazy. I'm not killing someone to feed your paranoia. Do we at least get a little referral? I want to do one. You're awfully quick to trust someone who offed her colleagues and called it a good start. Out of my office. We're done. This is why I always ask for half my payment up front. You think maybe she's got an itchy trigger finger? I don't want to find out. I said get out. Really? Wow, that's... a really unsatisfying ending to a quest. You know what, man? She had nothing on her. That's I hate that. It doesn't look like I made enemies though. Well, so far. I wonder if we could have said something different. How far back do we got? 1922. Why not the first one? Because that's the one I just before I shot her. Oh. You say before? Or after oh no, it's a quick save. That might be from coming up the elevator. It weren't hard to load it. I wish you just load the other one. Hmm. Interesting. I see. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So okay. load this one. That was like a minute before. I'm gonna be like, mm, not yet, I haven't completed it yet. I'll get to it. So, Harlow was rottener than a week old Borst. Big surprise. People all over the world. Sub light, more like subpar. More like kill ya, Hagen. 
because you killed her. <laughs> that's a that's a good point. That's a solid. You run past it. Well, it's things are happening. Okay. Look, I made it on the thing. Okay, stop being a little Mitch. All right, save it now. All right. Is it done? Let's see. I see. Uh, anything about the assault cruiser Cornelius Vanderbilt? Not as much as I'd like. The board dispatched it to Earth on a resupply mission, I think. Why? Dr. Shortran sent a research query via cruiser and never heard back. Interesting. It's possible the board wanted the cruiser to disregard ancillary tasks. But to what end? I'll have someone look into it. But for the moment, we're pissing in the wind and shooting in the dark. Considering how you get around, you'll probably find answers before I do. Okay. Uh. Yeah, right? Yeah. Well, damn. Nope, she didn't like that. Contractor grew a conscience. As your employer, I'm both angry and disappointed. Technically, I owe you an exit interview. You're crazy. I'm not killing someone to feed your paranoia. Seeing as you're the first one to complain about my paranoia, have you ever considered that you might be the problem? Out of my op. Nope. This is why. You think? I think it doesn't matter what we answer. Yeah, I think she's just mad. That's fine. Quest is done, my dudes. Oh, this is getting real small. You want to just do this? The main, yeah, sure. All right. We didn't see any dang aliens. Dang it! It was just a lie. It was all some bullshit. That would have been so cool. Now can we spend all our stuff? That's the lady who ran the energy weapons place in Freeside. No, Michael. <sighs> what a waste. I'm the dude who ends the game with 67 rockets for his rocket launcher because yeah, he just clearly. doesn't want to waste them. Who knows? I may is, need maybe them. Maybe this isn't the last mission. Maybe there's more. We'll see, I guess. Oh, that's where all my cool weapons are. And there they shall stay. Where did I? <laughs> yeah, man, I, I ain't got. I, I don't. Where do I go? I'll let you figure it out. Are you fucking with me right now? Sam, my vacuum tube. You did good. You did good. You're about to assault the labyrinth of Tartarus to determine the fate of the Halcyon colony. If there's anything you want to do before you enter the prison, do it now. Before you cross the point of no return. I'm gonna save the game in a new save. Fire evacuate. So that we can quick save without worrying about never turning back. Alright, you ready? Yeah. Oh, see? I'll just, I guess I'll just do it. Yeah, they already came up with that for me. I am pleased to inform you that we have arrived at the labyrinth. Please be advised that the punishment for trespassing is execution. Please be advised that electrical storms on the surface of Tartarus make departure impossible at this time. Know anything useful? Resident count is as follows. 3,071. Resident deaths including but not limited to executions, are as follows. 1,684. Yes. Resident escapes are as follows. Zero. Oh, boy. The interior can be chilly. Take a scarf with you, Captain. I would also ask that you leave your Captain's ID with me in the event that you do not return. Nice try, but not a, you promise not to leave without me? I can make the assurance that I will not leave with another Captain. Unless you do not return within 876,541,652 hours. Hmm. Oh, speak of the devil. Captain, I am receiving a transmission from the prison's docking authority now. Attention, unauthorized spacecraft. This is a maximum security installation. Your presence here is an explicit violation of UDL corporate policy. You are hereby confined to your docking platform until a ticket detailing your crimes has been filed and notarized, at which point your vessel will be seized and you will be executed. 
Well, of all the places to get arrested, what the hell is with you people land and landing violations? Wait, isn't this Terra 2? My mistake. I'll just, uh, I'll just leave. I kind of like that one. Your ship is not permitted to leave until you remit payment for your fines and submit yourself to execution. What? Only after your smoking corpse is thrown from an airlock will we lift the lockdown on your spacecraft. Captain, I would not recommend this course of action. Same. Oh, look at all these 70s we got. Hey, how do I know you're the real officer under that helmet? Show me your biometric ID. Fine, execute the chairman's eyebrow stylist over a lost biometric ID. That'll end well. You hull head, don't you know who I am? Transmit your biometric ID so I know who to fire. I like three. Huh? Oh, yes, sir. Right away, sir. I just couldn't see you clearly before. Screen's on the fritz. Damn thing. But for the record, now that I hear you, I totally recognize you. Totally. You're, um, you, of course. Obviously. Wow. Anyway, Tartar Stalking Authority signing up. Hang on. Another ship just pulled into your dock. Wait, is that from the Groundbreaker? What the? Pay no mind to that. Just have a pleasant day. Transmission terminated. Biometric ID received. Transferring data to external cartridge. How can I be of assistance? Let's get out of here. here. Oh, that's pretty funny. Maybe this avoids like a straight on attack when you. I mean, the it's only gonna last for so long though, you know. Right. All right. Who are we taking? Uh, I'm fine with the same team. Yeah, sure. While sneaking indicates your hands and your hands become more noticeable. Oh, we don't have our thing on. That's nice. Oh, now we will, though. All right. Oh, boy. Jeez Louise. And here we go. Oh, these guys are gonna help you out. Might as well let them do their thing. Who are these people? They're helping you out. Hmm. Don't waste your thingy, man. Oh my god, I walk a little bit off the path and you're like, Stop waste! Because it's a waste! I mean, it's gonna be gone, dude. Oh boy. Oh boy. I just wanna kill this dude. Hey, you can kill him later. Because I'm sure they'll have to. You might as well just shoot him, honestly. <laughs> I mean, we're gonna get to a point where, like, we're gonna be surrounded by guys. Wow, those dudes did nothing when they came out of their little their little chip. They killed, like, one dude. Time to go. Well, you should probably just be in cover. You just were kind of standing in the open. Also has an ability. Well, she's not close enough. Oh. Let's see if this. Let's see if this is better. Fifty-four. Oh man, we're finally getting armor that's like on the level. Any of these better? Six. There's no way. There is not a single gun in the rest of the game that you're going to pick up that is as good as those.
Nice. Do we have a thing that I can sell? I do like your strategy of literally turning around like a little girl and running. It's that's great. it's been working for me. I think I feel like it's really where my it's really where I find my strength. That's really where I, my my stride. It's just hilarious. Where you literally just scream, turn around and run. I mean that's where I. It's amazing. Shut the hell up. How about that? I like they're still giving me bit cartridges. So Harlow was rottener than we called for. Big surprise. You yeah, said I'm that like sure this is the last mission. It she said that like, like three it. times now. Is her catchphrase? Well, you're out of disguise, so they're gonna shoot at you. So you might as well kill them. What? It hurts everything. It's just death. Ooh, right control helmet gold. Security blade ultra. I don't know what that is. That's probably some bullshit food. Man, I'm glad we upped our storage capacity because... How about you? How about you, ladies? Can you guys use any of this? 43, 49, deal. 33, 54. Uh, and how about you? 52 and 52. 53. What about their weapons? Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Hear that. That's, yours are actually fine. You can give her a better melee weapon. Do we have a better one melee weapon? I think that one thing we have is, right? No. 231? 231? 369. Yeah. Not hers, I mean. Uh, oh, yeah, right on. Yeah, because hers is 120. There you go. All right. Oh, the weather outside is frightful. Can't get in there with my rifle. I'm out of the disguise. Show me where I can kill these guys. Well, at least we're not going to run out of ammo. A list of passwords for something called RAM. There are three columns, only one is legible. The rest has been scratched out. One Akande. That should be helpful. Akande forever! <laughs> Solid. Let's give my corporation service award. God, dude, this is so much ammo. You know what? Let's keep on trucking. Oh, oh, oh. This is like a secret entrance. <laughs> wow, that was... I guess if you could... Maybe you can't open that door from the other side? I don't know. I have no idea, but... Are you okay? What's going on? Oh, man. All right. Those are my passwords, dude. <laughs> it is passwords, my dude. Let's make sure we're prepped. Locked and loaded, as the kids say. Nice of them to leave us a few options. Hello, my dudes. 
Hmm. How do you do, my fellow kids? Nothing to see here, just a corporate guy getting, being corporate-y. Oh, shit. Oh, this is a dead end. Okay. Oh, yes. Just slide off. Oh, no. Oh. That, that would have been cool. That would have been real cool, and I felt like that was... Jump up. Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, God. Nothing to see here, boys. Just a man in a costume. Did you actually make it all the way? Find the end. I guess we're going up here. Wow, you actually cleared this room. That's amazing. Huh. Hmm. Oh, yes. Fantastic. You know what, Michael? Now I'll probably... Now I'll probably tinker. Well, you can't tinker here. Let's see their armor, though. Can't I? Oh. Well, let's see what their armor they got. 35. 40. 22. 63. Oh. I don't know if that's better than what we have on right now, though, because I feel like that's not going to be... Out. For some reason, I feel like that's not going to be as good when we're looking at it on ourselves, right? Where... See, like, where is that 62? No, that's something you can buy. Oh, oh I was in the wrong check menu. Your helmet. I got gotcha. you. Check your own helmet. You didn't check your own helmet. I did. It's like fifty-two. It's like fifty-two or fifty-four. No, that was her helmet. Fifty-two. It's oh. Yeah. Fifty-eight. Okay, it's still better. Might as well buy it then. I think it's only like five hundred too. That's like steel. Any good guns? Probably not. But There's we literally can... no guns. Oh, okay. Mono MO skis. Alright, you're trash. 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 And trash. That's the one we, so just, we just bought. They're not as good. We already have yeah, we already have good enough armor. Alright, and next we're going to go repair all our things. Nice. T -t -t tinker my dudes. Okay, that, nice. that's at max. That's a lot, jeez. Go here. What are we wearing? Is this what we're wearing? Yeah, but we're about to change helmets. Change to this. Eighty-four now. This is, is this our armor? Yeah. How can you? T oh, because it's equipped. Yeah, sure. Oh, is this sixty-four on us? No. Where is that sixty-four armor? That's the that's your pals, I think. They have better armor than we do. Yeah. Huh. See now it's fifty four. Now it's sixty eight. Maybe it's just like your bonuses. Try just swap it anyway. See if it's better on us. It won't be. Why? Because this is base 54. This is base 58. Oh, okay. Whatever, that's fine. I'm not going to mess with it. Uh, e. Tinker. My armor. No, it's 3,000. Eh, whatever. Okay. Save ourselves 10 grand. We don't no, know what's going to happen, so I'm just going to leave it, man. Do these yeah, other vendors enough. have different things? enough Ooh. upgrades. Nothing super exciting here. A lot of stuff for our companions, but I don't really want to waste... 84? See, this is why you save the money, you stupid Mitch. 
you still can afford it. Handily. I don't think any of the weapons are going to be worth it. Oh, look at these little cute outfits. Two more. 10, 41, 41, 26, 10. All right. 960, not bad, but we still have better, so. We could buy one of those for our bro. 17, 17, 9, 4. Okay. It's not bad at John. 84, that's a big jump. 64 and 52. It's, yeah, still better. Yep. 53, 57. 59, 53. Okay, so. So. Oh, yeah. Tinker. 94. Oh, nice. Nice. And now we're finally going to do one more thing. We're going to sell. Our old shit. Alright. Oh wow. G2G. That was a lot of transition to the pit. That's exactly where I want to go, the pit. Oh god. Hey man. Yeah man. That's like leaving a $200 bill on your <laughs> crackers. On your crackers. Hey, don't leave money on your crackers, Michael. Access the storage manifest. Okay. Cool. Access the architectural records. Cool. Okay. I'll exit. Well, see you later. That was very handy and useful to me. Still disguised. Hello, fellow gentlemen. Hello, my name is Milos. How do you do, fellow kids? See you later. Hey, this uh, disguise thing is pretty handy. Yeah, yeah. Is this yeah. where you're supposed to go, though? Probably. Yeah, it was literally that was where the marker was. Oh, it was. And now, it is over here. I, you know, Get I don't. Get in there, troops. For Monarch. For Halcyon. Oh, more friends. They're downstairs, though. You can. Can we get them. 40 meters in this disguise? We can try. Oh, I don't. Oh, oh. Go to sneak mode. Oh. Hey, we made it. Might have to kill that guy, though. I think I was quiet enough that no one knows I'm a bad guy now. Yeah, I think you're good. Well, at least they don't didn't hear it or whatever. Let's go towards the door, man. I was thinking of close There's enemies over there. Oh shit! Go to the right. To the right. To the right. That's the left. To the where? Where to the right? There's a hole in the wall right there. There's a hole in my wall, Michael B. Haha, <laughs> idiots! Oh, my thing's back on too. Well, well, <laughs> well, see you later. <laughs> the game just quit on us oh. randomly. Well, that's... that was super random. I'm glad we. I'm glad I f I'm such a fervent F fiver. Yeah, that's good. Jesus, that was awkward. Wow, it was just like there was no there was no freeze. Yeah, it just was like, peace out. It was like you hit exit game. Yeah, but it's, it's it like didn't even usually they didn't even get confirmation. It's not like, are you sure you want to exit the game? Can we talk? Sure. Hey, Captain. Next time we're in Byzantium, 
there's something I've been meaning to do. You want your side quest now at the end of the game? <laughs> What's that? I haven't actually talked to my folks in a while. Shocking, right? <laughs> All right, we're going back to Byzantium, I guess. Them a visit. Given the dangerous life I lead, they've got to be worried sick. Funny, you don't strike me as the type that keeps in touch. Which brings us to where we are today. Several messages and a few years late. See, I'm originally from Byzantium, born and raised. On the and playground is where I spent most of my days. Surprise. And now you just want to catch up with him? Yeah, exactly. I don't see why you can't go see them if it's, when it's convenient. I'm proud of you. Of course we should reconnect with your parents. Reconnect is a strong word. Wow. And uh, I was thinking you'd come too. Why would you want me to meet your parents? Because it would be fun. There's more to this. What's this really about? It's, well, they know me as Marilyn the surgeon. They don't know Ellie the pirate sawbones. But you, your authentic rabble, true riffraff, when they see you, they'll get it. Wow. So I'm going to show your pleb friend off to your fancy parents, real mature. Oh, that's, you got to say that. That's insane. Come on. I didn't leave home and become a pirate because I enjoy making responsible decisions. Okay, we'll go. Great. And when we get there, draw out your rough edges a bit. If you've got an outfit you haven't washed in a while, maybe one with some blood stains, wear that one. Wow. I'll take care of dressing myself, thanks. What? Oh, and help yourself to the good snacks and put your feet on the coffee table. Mother hates that. Wow, wow. this is such an immature view. <laughs> what a teen. I, it's Basically. almost like you want me to be on my worst behavior. That's the idea. Anything else? She basically wants you to pass her off as her weird boyfriend so she can embarrass her parents. I take it you've got something to say about Harlow. Yeah, she's mentioned it three times. What did I tell you? His down with the man shtick was just an act. No one who yammers that much means half of it. Don't sound so excited. That was Felix's friend. Obviously not. And better for Felix to know that now rather than become the next Trask. Just because Harlow tried to make crooked doesn't mean everyone's like that. Yeah. Don't get all mushy on me now. Come on, what did we just learn? People look out for their own interests. It's a fundamental law of nature. Same as gravity and conservation of motion. Hmm. You can't live your life thinking the worst of everyone. Sure I can. In fact, I bet you I live a lot longer. Maybe you're right, but I'd rather try for something better. Ever consider that looking out for others can be in your best interest? I'm warning you, that reverse psychology stuff doesn't work on me. Even when you, even you never really go it alone. You usually throw your crew, your lot in with a crew. It's, yeah. Sure do. And unlike you, Captain, the rest of us don't get a big fancy room with wall-to-wall -wall windows. But let's forget about that, please. Anyway, you really want to tell me you're helping the scientist because you think he'll save the colony? As a matter of fact, I am. And here I thought I'd seen it all. This galaxy must be bigger than I'd thought. Enough about Harlow, though. Anything else? If we're going to work together, I'd like to be more about you. What can you tell me about Byzantium? Head back to the... No, let's go. Let's a roll out. All right, so look, look. We got all that, we got all that story out so of the way. So if we can still play the game after this, then we can go do that. <laughs> Doubt it. Go this way. Check out the thing. Uh, 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 get all the junk. Read all the relevant texts. Dark matter bar, don't care. That just sounds like some food bullshit. How do you Good do, day, fellow, fellow gentlemen? <laughs> Go on the platform. Saved it here. All right. Because I'm one step closer to the edge, Michael. And I'm about to break. Oh, man, Get in there, blue. troops. For Monarch. For Halcyon. I'm good, dude. You don't know me. Just be a sneak.
Oh man. Oh well. Too much. No reason for it. Okay. Go that way. This just seems longer because they're going around this little crooked. Like, this is, seems a lot longer to go that way. You can also ignore this guy in this room. You don't have to shoot him. You might be right. Alright, let's see if it drops the ball. I'm gonna regular save. Come on, don't you don't you crash. Alright, I don't think we got this far last time, so. We did not. We did not. I did not hand her. I did not. Oh hi Mark. <laughs> oh, they opened the door without you. That's weird. Oh, we just went behind everybody, didn't we? Yeah. This is the most sneakiest I've been. And it's because... Well, you know why. Well, I think we have to go down what? there. Oh. Buddy, don't worry about it. There's no one here, you stupid fuck. <laughs> That's rather rude. I think we have to be down here, right? Yeah. Why even give me a ladder? You're probably gonna have to kill that guy. So you might as well kill that guy. Is there a chokehold move that I can use behind him? I don't think so. Although he isn't paying attention, so. Yeah, there's no way. You just oh, gotta start no. shooting. Hey, you! Ah, fuck. Yeah, they saw you. Oh, you got your thingy back. Yeah, that's weird. I guess because you were like seen and then not seen again? Or because I stole their essence. Shit. That's that's garbage armor. And going the wrong way. Good call. I'm just I'm just oh. picking up what they're putting. You don't putting need any of it, man. It's not worth your juice. You don't know what's worth my juice, Michael. Sure I do. You don't know how much I value my juice. Oh man, we're getting so close, I can feel it. Unseal that door! Saving it. Oh, interesting. Huh. What up, fam? <laughs> it's your boy! It's your boy, Little Schmoozy. Little Schmoozy? Yeah. Huh. Also known as Captain Bort. <laughs> we're getting boardy up in this bitch! Pew, 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 pew. All right, seventeen. We can definitely. Oh. Waste of company ammo. Goodbye. Uh, Zippity doo dah, Dave. You went over my helmet. All right, twenty-five. We can do twenty-five, but that's not twenty-five in a straight line, unfortunately. Yeah, you're getting caught here. Shut up, Michael. Oh, you sneaky little devil. Oh, you made it. Dang. Whoa! Got him! You don't know shit about Bort Boy! Bort Boy. 
It is I, Bort Boy. After all you've done, all the work you've destroyed, all the money you've cost me, your misguided crusade has doomed Halcyon. Doomed? Phineas and I are saving the colony. I'm just rooting out corruption one idiot at a time. What can I say? I like to cause trouble. I like one. That crackpot's plan is ludicrous. We have steps, action items, budgets, and reports. All he's got is a guilty conscience and lofty dreams. In any other circumstance, I'd admire your boldness. In this one, however, I have only two words for you. Fuck off. Whoa now, there's no call for hostility. You aren't one to mince words. Chairman Rockwell, just the man I'm here to kill. I'm gonna say one. Sure. No call for... You. You unbelievable bastard. Sophia should be the one wasting her time with you, but you killed her. I'll have you hanged, quartered, bankrupted. Thankfully, you're in a prison already. Find the nearest cell and wait until I'm done here. Then I'll drag you to the executioner myself. I'm not waiting for anything. This colony needs saving right now. Oh, of course. How long until you're done? A felony? I've made a terrible mistake. Please don't arrest me. I like two. Sure. Is that sarcasm? Do you know what I do to people who employ the lowest, most base form of humor? I fire them. Alas, as you are woefully unemployed, I'll have to do the next best thing and have you killed. Well, this guy's a piece of shit, In man. In the next room is the finest auto mechanical purveyor of death ever made. Try not to scratch the paint with your skull. It was fucking expensive. I'm sure we could talk about this, Rockwell. Let's work something out. I'll be there before you know it. I can't wait to get there and kill you. This is going to be the highlight of my year. I'm sure we can talk about this. Absolutely not. A Conde was always the sociable one, not me. Need I repeat the magic two words? Fine, I'll be there before you know it. Well, I'm on my way. Prepare your head for bashing. Well, you tried. We did try. Oh, no. Save it new. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, I don't think you can talk about it at that point. No, I think that guy's just gonna... Sealed and... Let's make sure all our guns are in a... If you're gonna destroy it. I don't know, man. Oh, I got scared for a second. Oh, you saved just recently, so it's not that big. Is that it? Look at that thing. Is a robot? Is this just a stupid robot? I could kill a robot. our stupid robot to kill the stupid robot. Oh, ram. Oh, wow. Oh, that knocked that thing on its ass. Really good. Uh, it has a lot of health. It really does. Oh, you keep knocking it down? That's great. Yeah, this is 100% the last battle. Oh, I was hoping it wouldn't be able to get in here with me. That's awkward. Wrong, bitch. Oh, God. Yeah, it'll ram you, so watch out for that. It'll literally ram you. Dead. Wow, this is really difficult. Is this real? You almost killed it. I don't think so, man. Yeah, you got his health down like that much. No fucking way I did. Yeah, you did. No. You totally did. No, don't lie to me. I'm not lying to you. Make sure you use yeah, both their abilities. Now shoot the shit out of it.
use the abilities. Nope. God. Oh. That, that was actually pretty close. I agree. That was pretty close. I think the little the little shit drones on the outside are the hardest thing. You can somehow keep Pravardi alive to keep knocking it down. I think that's. I'll shoot the shield. This should this should get it, I would imagine. Ah oh, fuck. Got it! Oh all the other things died with it. Thanks That's fucking god. Alright. Let's check out the room. No, they, they yeah. Let's go back to my regular, my human killing gun. Looks like you waste all your money, idiot. I made a lot of scratches on it, stupid. <laughs> Do you have any shotguns? I don't know. Maybe. I don't care. Any? I think you said shotguns. You said shock. Yeah. Yeah. I thought you said shot. I thought you said shot. <laughs> really? Wow. You got one hit <laughs> by your companion. That's hilarious. That was anticlimactic. What if Phineas is a madman? That's hilarious how you just one shot that guy. I can hardly believe my eyes. You didn't have to do this, you know. Risk your life just to save mine. Are you kidding? The board never stood a chance against me. You know I wouldn't let anything happen to you. Do you have any idea how much trouble I went through? Yeah. That's other one or two. Like one. No, I expect they didn't. You're a force of nature, aren't you? You've left the board in tatters, but Halcyon is still on the verge of starvation. I just hope we're not too late. All right, he seems like you a decent dude. You and I are going to have to work harder than ever to save Halcyon. I'm afraid the situation is far worse than any of us ever anticipated. I don't like the sound of that. Great, and I was just about to pop open some drinks and celebrate. Earth has gone dark. We haven't received a single message in three years. There's been no communication, no signals, nothing. Two years ago, the Earth's Directorate's frigate disappeared on their way back to Earth. We don't know what they discovered when they arrived, or if they arrived at all. They haven't exactly been hands-on around here anyway. So there's one less rubber stamp to worry about. Earth is humanity's home planet, Miss Fenhill. The psychological effects of losing our original home will be devastating. You mean we're all alone out here? Really alone? I'm afraid so, Miss Holcomb. Halcyon is the only home we have left. Returning to Earth is no longer an option. Earth isn't going to help us. No one's going to help us now. We're alone out here, and I don't know if we're going to survive. Wait, hold on, I need to ask you something. Yes, yes, certainly. I'll help however I can. You mentioned a frigate disappearing? You might have heard of the Earth Directorate's frigate. Half the colony's entire military was on that ship. They were returning to Earth when they vanished without a trace. That was two years ago. We haven't heard a word from them since. 
Whatever happened to Earth likely happened to them. There's something else. I know about the other colonists, Phineas. What does that mean? Did I... I wasn't trying to hide the truth from you, but after all you've done, I owe you an explanation. Yes, I experimented on the Hope's colonists. Each of my experiments ended in catastrophic failure. Each of my subjects died in agony. You are my first and only success. I didn't tell you about the others because I didn't want to burden you. My failures are my own to bear, not yours. I forgive you. Well, better late than never. What do you think? Are you a murderer and liar? Uh, one or two. Thank you. <laughs> Perhaps in time I'll learn to forgive myself. My apologies. I need to get a hold of myself. We've far more pressing issues to worry about right now. If you have any more questions, ask me. I'll answer as best I can. What do you think happened? I don't know what happened, but something must have gone horribly wrong. I don't know why Earth's gone silent. I don't even know if Earth exists anymore. Oh, that's a big jump. We have no <laughs> connection back to Earth, and return is likely impossible. We're completely alone out here. I don't have any more questions. we got work to do. I had hoped your fellow colonists might hold the key to saving Halcyon, but I don't have nearly enough chemicals to revive them all. I'll do what I can. Pokemon, gotta revive late. them all. It's time I return to my lab. Halcyon? I'll try to save as many of the Hope's colonists as I can. You're under no obligation to help me. You've done enough already. What else am I gonna do? Somebody has to ruin, run this colony. I'm the only one competent. I'm the only competent person left. You don't have to ask. I'll help you. I'm gonna do whatever I've always done. Whatever I want all the time. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, thank you. Are you gonna say one? Yeah. Need all wow. The I can get. I'm the only competent I one I've here. Asked too much <laughs> of you already. I revived you into a strange and unfamiliar colony. I put your life at risk. I made you an accomplice to my own ends. We were going to save this colony, you know. That's what I told myself when I pulled you from the hope. You and I were going to set everything right. Now, I don't know what to think. Earth is gone, and we are going to need a miracle to survive another generation. I always suspected Halcyon might collapse one day. I just... I just thought we would have more time. So Waldo says, this is one of the pro one of my problems. Phineas is cast as purely a good guy with the no practical issues. The is that everything in the universe happens according to the grand plan. But the stranger that arrived in Halcyon was an unplanned variable. From the moment he landed in Emerald Vale, his actions altered the course of history. The events on Tartarus brought about the end of the board's authority. But the board's mistakes would haunt the colony for decades to come. The damage they left behind would require the work of a generation to repair. Dr. Phineas Wells began reviving a handful of the Hope's colonists. Engineers, scientists, technicians, and intellectuals. They were among the brightest minds the Earth had ever sent out into the stars. The Hope's scientists and engineers woke up in a colony descending headlong into total collapse. With no way to return to Earth, they had no choice but to band together and devote themselves to the cause of saving Halcyon. The people of Halcyon were nothing if not hardy. In the absence of the board's authority, many of the colony's settlements banded together with a single purpose in mind, survival. Life was especially hard in the years to come. Some towns dissolved by attrition and starvation but most of them found a way to carry on. In the years to come, Halcyon was forced to reckon with its newfound freedom. The board was gone, and for better or worse, the colony was responsible for its own destiny. As the colony struggled to survive, the inspirational story of the iconoclast spread like wildfire, and Graham was able to bring many of the smaller Terra 2 townships into the fold. However, his zealous obsession with spreading the word blinded him to the needs of a growing organization, and the movement was unsustainable at scale. The iconoclast way seemed to work best, 
and ultimately petered out on Monarch. Consumed by paranoia, Lilia Hagen took Sublight Salvage in a controversial direction, openly accusing board officials of an extraterrestrial conspiracy. One day, an accident at the Groundbreakers' docking bay silenced her right. forever. Time would tell if her replacement could keep the Sublight family together. Adelaide McDevitt replaced Reed Thompson as the leader of Edgewater. She and her followers transformed Edgewater in their image. Anyone loyal to Reed was pressured into leaving town, and those who stayed behind adapted to her way of life. Adelaide transformed the old cannery into a new garden. The nearby Edgewater Cemetery provided a convenient source of fertilizer. Under the leadership of June Lake Tennyson, the groundbreaker held firm against corporate influence. The ship's mechanical stability gave Junle the time to educate a promising generation of engineers schooled in her family's traditions. The future of the groundbreaker looks promising. The rediscovery of the hope and the abandonment of the lifetime employment program forced Byzantium to come to terms with some uncomfortable realities about the state of Halcyon. While Byzantines were reluctant to surrender the luxuries they'd grown accustomed to, the board's diminished authority gave them little choice in the matter. Nearly everyone had to learn to make do with less. Some even had to get oh jobs. Oh boy, not that. <laughs> not jobs! It was a dark time indeed. <laughs> oh no! Ellie savored her adventures on the unreliable. Once they were done, she returned to life as usual running missions of dubious legality, shunning respectable work, and living life to the fullest. She meant to reach out to her one-time captain, but she was always bad at keeping in touch. Oh, dang. Life in Halcyon was sobering for Felix Maelstone. The grand revolution he dreamed of never came. There was no great awakening for the colony, no celebrations in the streets, there was only the hard, desperate work of trying to repair a broken colony. Felix never had a head for numbers, but if there was labor to be done, he was there to help. Eventually, Felix realized that the work of a revolution was done with two hands. As much as he enjoyed his adventures aboard the Unreliable, the vicar known as Max eventually decided that it was time to move on to live out the life he had sought so long to create. He knew there were many in the colony who carried burdens much worse than the ones he had struggled with, and he devoted himself to easing their suffering wherever he could. He only ever took up arms again to defend the defenseless, unshackled from a lifetime of striving and fighting the universe and himself. Vicar Maximilian de Soto was finally at peace. Though Parvati eventually grew comfortable aboard the Unreliable, she never quite came out of her shell. She seemed to prefer the company of Ada to the crew, and she could often be found neck deep in cables and grease, telling Ada funny stories from her childhood. While the colony fell into chaos, she found an island of relative peace with Ada, and they formed an unusual bond. She decided to remain aboard the Unreliable permanently as its chief and sole engineer. Nioka returned to Monarch to take another crack at making a permanent life for herself. She formed the Charon Group, a mercenary outfit of ragtag survivalists and wilderness experts. Anyone in need of a guide or just looking to throw back a beer and swap stories could find her camping on the trail or clearing an infestation. The SAM unit that accompanied you spread awareness of the product <laughs> line's superior sanitation and maintenance capabilities across what was left of the colony. This led to a boost in SAM unit sales. Well. Did you know that SAM units are the longest lasting, toughest acting cleaning solution in Halcyon? I didn't know Minister that. Clark was released from house arrest and That's his contact with you gave him a sense of renewed purpose and vigor. Once it became clear that no help would be coming from Earth, he threw his considerable efforts and talents into helping Halcyon manage the crisis before it. As for Dr. Phineas Wells, he spent his remaining years in his orbital lab. 
He was never able to come to terms with his own past, troubled by the decision of placing all his faith in the first colonist he ever revived, the infamous Captain of the Unreliable. The revival project yielded mixed results. Phineas, weighed down by limited support and his own guilt, struggled to revive more than a handful of scientists and engineers. They made a heroic effort to solve the colony's problems, but with small numbers and facing long odds, their solutions never caught on. Only a few of the Hope's colonists were successfully revived. I wonder if what happened if we well gave him all the gas. before he could see the fruits of his labor. If what? If he we gave him all the gas. a haunted man, crushed by the guilt of his failures. Small, petty factions squabble over what remains of the colony. Every attempt to reach out to Halcyon's neighbors is met with silence. And what about you, the unplanned variable in the history of Halcyon? Long after Wells passed away, you carried on his work with more energy, determination, and brilliance than he could ever muster. The years that followed were hard, but Halcyon survived by the efforts of the Hope's most promising colonists, the greatest of which was you. No one knows what's happened to Earth, and no one knows what the future has in store for Halcyon. All we know for certain is this. The name of the unreliable and that of its intrepid captain will remain the subject of countless stories for years to come. Oh man, that's the end. That was the game? That, that was, was the game. game. Okay, so all of a sudden, this is when I promised Phineas Cast is a pretty good guy with no practical issues. Even the dark side of the people he's killing is completely ameliorated by his remorse over. Yeah, but I think that's fine. I, I think I like enough. Uh, the gray area that you're not sure if Philly, Phineas is a bad guy. So it's causing you to make decisions based on that. I don't think he actually has to be uh, morally gray. I think you just are, are, I think you just have to think he is. Because also, that's enough to compel your decisions. I think if he turned out to be like a really big bad guy, it would have been super obvious. Yeah, and it's just, I don't know if that's even that satisfying. Because like, if you make a shitty decision towards Phineas and then you find out he's a really good guy... I mean, that's also kind of a cool outcome, right? But, I don't know. Either way, this game was awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching it. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it as much as we did. I imagine there are some... This is shorter than I thought it was going to be. So, uh, yeah, like for, 40 hours. right, for sure. Maybe they just assume you do more. So uh, I'm going to look up time to complete. The Outer Worlds can be completed in about 15 hours if you ignore its many optional quests and stick to the main story. Hmm. How long to beat? Uh, where's the how long to beat page? How long to beat? There we go. Uh, main story is 11 hours. Main and extra is 22 hours. Completion is 34 hours. So all styles, 23 hours. So about 23 hours is about the average. Which is about... And we got that's like about where hours. we are, yeah. No, because this is part of 11. So, so 22 hours? Yeah, about so yeah, 22 hours. So we're like pretty much average. But uh, yeah, actually you can go to load game and we're at 19 hours and 56 minutes. So we're actually 20 hours exactly almost. Probably 21, because that was probably saved before we did half an hour ago. Yeah, but either way, thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Hope you hopefully you enjoyed this. And if you guys have stuck with this or the all 11 parts or 12 parts or however many parts, be sure to let me know in the comments if you guys would like to see other games and what other games you'd like to see. And uh, let me know if you guys had different endings as well, because the ending seems like it would be definitely different depending on how we played it. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching and hopefully uh, we'll see you guys next time.